Okay, hello YouTube, this is Joey, playing Minecraft, and talking about the issues of the day. Not going to talk about Minecraft, maybe a little bit if I get surprised. Um, ooh, zombie pigmen. See, there I am talking about Minecraft. What I do want to talk about is Rebecca Watson uh, saying that she doesn't want strange men to proposition her in hotel elevators at four in the morning when she's drunk. So I have to say that I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem with her being uncomfortable with that. I don't have a problem with her uh, telling everybody that she's uncomfortable with that. And I also don't have a problem with her telling men that they should not do that. And guys out there um if you were really smart you would listen to what she was saying because the here's the deal she's she's not saying that you can never ask a woman out she's not saying that uh you can't ask a woman to go back to your hotel room with her you know you you to ask her back to your hotel room you, she's not saying any of that what she's saying is this particular instance was extremely poor timing poor judgment um and that that's that's it i mean that it's that's all it boils down to is this guy has the worst timing ever uh she had previously stated don't don't do this don't don't p put me in a situation where i'm going to feel uncomfortable and just don't do it and this guy did like immediately afterwards i mean she sat in a bar talking about it for however many hours and then this guy just goes and does it right there and that's what that's what upset her that's what made her want to make the video <laughs> was just the simple fact that this guy has the worst timing ever and it's and it is all about timing it's all about you know what 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 you say when you say it the circumstances and it's all about context context if you've ever taken freshman composition in college uh, I know the first thing we learned about was context and <laughs> um, if you know the context with which your author is speaking or writing, then you know uh, a little bit more about what the author was trying to say uh, with that. And in this same way, it's, it's all about context. And the context of the situation was that it was four in the morning, that people were drunk, and people were on a hotel elevator in a strange city with people they don't know and asking somebody back to your hotel room for coffee is basically saying let's go back to my hotel room and fuck so that's why she got uncomfortable because I'm sure anybody would be uncomfortable. Let's put it this way. You know, what if what if you were on a hotel, same situation, you and another man, you're a guy, he's a guy, you're not gay, maybe he is, who knows, he asked you to go back to his hotel room for coffee. Are you going to be comfortable with that, you know, especially maybe if you know the guy's gay, are you going to be comfortable with that? And I'm not trying to, you know, set up a scenario here where you know you're a homophobe or something like that if you don't want to go back to his hotel room for coffee uh, I'm just saying are you going to be comfortable with that and because you don't know this person you don't know what their real intentions are you know maybe he's got a gun in his hotel room and he is going to rape you you don't know so it's going to make you a little uncomfortable and that's all she was saying is that in this scenario this guy's timing. If this guy's 
uh, intentions were honorable, uh, he had poor timing. And, you know, in the future, just don't do that particular thing in that particular way. So, <laughs> um, uh, that's all I have to really say about it. I mean, I know Richard Dawkins got involved and said some crazy stuff, you know. I can't remember the logical fallacy that is. Maybe straw man, maybe slippery slope. Or probably sh it was straw man because he was, you know, setting up maybe scenarios that are certainly valid scenarios, but had nothing to do with the situation that that Rebecca was talking about. And her her statements were not a uh, blanket man hating statements that men should never talk to women uh should never ask them for sex or never ask them out or anything like that it was in this scenario uh use better judgment use better judgment and i'm you know everybody's fallible this guy made a mistake uh, she's not pressing charges. She's not calling the police. She's not saying that this guy raped her or, uh, you know, mentally abused her or anything like that. This guy made a mistake. Uh, she got off the she got off the elevator as quick as she could, and uh, made a innocuous comment about it <laughs> on her YouTube uh, update and. Uh, that that's all that that's all there is there, and I don't I just don't I don't understand why people can't understand the simplicity of the situation, and uh, I I guess I can understand it, but I don't under I don't understand why it's, it it got to be such a big deal, why people think that it's. It, why it got so blown out of proportion why it, it got to the point where people were talking about you know feminist man haters and things like that I just don't think it got to that I don't think it should have gotten to that point um, when she initially made the comment I, I had kind of a similar reaction you know well can't guys you know ever ask a woman out you know but uh the the more I've thought about it, the more I've I've come to understand that that's not what she was saying. That's with you know that's not what she was saying. Her whole deal was this comment was inappropriate for the circumstances, and I agree with that. So uh, if you want to blow it out of proportion, that's fine. That's certainly your right to have whatever opinion you want to have, but. Uh, th there's no reason to. There's no reason to get over to overreact to this. There's no reason to think that uh, to put words in her mouth. There's no reason to, <laughs> to to think that she's saying that that men are evil and should never talk to women or never ask them out or never ask them to go back to their whole room hotel rooms and have coffee it's just the whole timing of the situation so that's all i have to say about it um hopefully i won't get any hate mail about this uh, i'm sure i will though uh actually i probably won't because nobody views my videos but uh there it is my opinion on that whole shenanigan, whatever you want to call it. So, peace out. Have a good day.